Welcome to our podcast where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will explore whether a steam world with water vapor in outer space could be habitable. Using the James Webb Space Telescope, scientists looked into the exoplanet GJ9827d in the constellation Pisces and found that this super-Earth has an atmosphere that is saturated with water vapor. The telescope was used by the Canadian Lead International Study to gather data on the atmosphere of GJ9827d, which is around 98 light-years away from Earth. In the study, it was found that the atmosphere of the planet has a high concentration of heavy molecules, which included a good amount of water vapor. Because of this, the astronomers believed that it was a steam world. At the start of the year, with the help of data collected by the Hubble Space Telescope, IREX researchers stated that they had found water in the atmosphere of GJ9827d, which made it the smallest exoplanet with a confirmed atmosphere. These major findings opened new ways for scientists who are searching for life outside our solar system. Till now, the detection of atmospheres near smaller planets closer to Earth was an elusive goal. Lead study author Piole Goroyev said, For now, all the planets we've detected that have atmospheres are giant planets, or at best, mini-Neptunes. He also said, These planets have atmospheres made up mostly of hydrogen, making them more similar to gas giants in the solar system than to terrestrial planets like Earth, which have atmospheres dominated by heavier elements. The observations were made by Piolet Goryeb and her team with the help of a Canadian instrument on JWST, the Near Infrared Image and Slitless Spectrograph. With the help of transmission spectroscopy, the scientists observed the starlight which passed through the atmosphere of the planet as it transited its host star GJ, 9827. The new JWST observations were then combined with preliminary HST observations to provide strong evidence about how the planet's atmosphere led to the observed spectral features, and it did not occur because of the contamination from the system's star. It was observed that the exoplanet GJ9827 stands different from others because of the composition of its atmosphere. Piole Goroyev combined JWST and HST data and showed that the atmosphere of GJ9827d is filled with heavier molecules and a quite large amount of water vapor, which is not the situation in the case of the hydrogen-dominated atmospheres of the larger planets. With the combination of data from JWST, near-infrared image, and slitless spectrograph with earlier HST data, Piole Goroyev and her team showed that the atmosphere of the planet is significantly different from those of larger planets. Piole Goroyev said, It's closer in molecular weight to the carbon dioxide or nitrogen-rich atmospheres that we are currently looking for on smaller rocky planets, where we would eventually look for life. That's all from this podcast. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.